Hello and welcome to another episode of Tech Cafication. In this video, I'm going to be looking, taking a look at Chrome OS. So if I take my virtual machine here, so I'm just going to let it boot up. Now Chrome OS was made by Google, as you may or may not know, and it is a great operating system for laptops. So I'm just going to enter as the guest account. So if you have a notebook, netbook, or a notebook, then this is what I, and if you want a nice, quick, simple to use um, operating system, this is what I recommend you use so it's got a it's basically a web browser interface so you can go to google.ca and you can do whatever it is that you normally do on the web browser you can go to the um, there's a web store so basically you can add applications like you would in in other operating systems to this Chromium operating system and use them offline. There's an Evernote app, there's um, Google Play, there's all kinds of all kinds of different things that you can see here. Um, there's even offline for Docs, then there's offline Google Docs. So to add something you just click this, it'll say add to um, Chrome and then you can access it in here there'll be all the list of all the all the things that you have and it'll show you the time the ethernet and the battery and if you go into the little settings things over here you can say settings and it will show you settings like you would on a computer so you have all this stuff which I won't talk too much about I'll just go through it quickly and when, when you first set it up, then it gives you a pretty good understanding of how to use a trackpad with Google, with the Google Chrome operating system. So to log out, you just hit exit guest session, and then it goes back to here. So you can add users, and it will remember your user account. And then to shut down, you just hit this little shutdown thing, and it turns off very quickly. Don't know why it's not doing it here. But if we hit shut down, that is how quickly it shuts down. And this is running in a virtual machine. Um, I can show you the specs of this vi virtual machine. So I have. System. I have one CPU, one gig of memory, and I have how big is my hard drive? I don't know how big my hard drive is. Three gigabytes. So you can basically run this on any computer and it will run ridiculously fast. So thanks for watching this video guys. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe.